you guys, welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you everything that I bought from Target and Sprout for healthy snack options. I also went to Trader Joe's, but they pretty much had nothing, so I'm not going to include Trader Joe's. And the reason I'm showing you guys all of these healthy snacks is because we're going on a trip in about a week. Actually, a week from today we leave. And as you guys know, my allergies make it really, really hard for me to eat out. So I'm basically supplying all of my food by bringing snacks on the trip. So I'll get more into detail with that as I show you guys what I got. But I'm going to just kind of walk you through everything and I try to really get healthy snack options. So I guess I will just get started and share with you guys what I got. So I'm going to start with what I found at Target because it was just two little things and then we will move on to Sprouts. But at Target, I found these That's It bars, and I've seen these advertised before. They're actually super awesome. The ingredients on the apple strawberry one is literally one apple and 12 strawberries. And then on the blueberry one, it's one apple and 20 blueberries. So these are super healthy. Of course, there's a lot of sugar in them because it's the natural sugar from the fruit. But there's no added sugars. It's dairy-free, dairy -free, gluten-free, soy-free. Um, it's just super good snack. And they don't taste like amazing, but they don't taste bad. Like I can easily just snack on these. So I'm super happy with these from Target. Everything else I got is from Sprouts. So I have this bag from Sprouts and these two bags from Sprouts. So I'm going to go through these with you guys. The first thing I got is this big bag of the Boom Chicka Pop popcorn. I'm sure you guys have heard of it. I got the sweet and salty one just because I'm a sweet person and I know I'm going to want something sweet while we're gone. So this is going to be my sweet option. Whoa, Bubba, come here. Why are you whining? You want to say hi? Look, you're on camera. Hello. Hello. So this is going to be my sweet option for when I want something sweet as a snack. And the ingredients in this are still very clean. It's popcorn, sunflower oil, cane sugar, and sea salt. So even though there's sugar in it, it's not like horrible ingredients. So I picked this up as a snack. And the next thing I got is two bags of these hippies. Is that what they're called? Yeah, hippies. So they're basically like little Cheetos made out of chickpeas. And I got them in the nacho vibes flavor and the bohemian barbecue flavor. And these ingredients are pretty clean. Everything's organic. Chickpea flour, rice flour, sunflower oil, tapioca starch, pea whole fiber, cane sugar, tomato, salt, onion, basically all the spices to make up the barbecue seasoning. Pretty much the same thing in the cheese one. And these are also vegan. So including the seasonings and the cheese seasoning, they're vegan. I've heard that these are delicious. So I'm hoping that they are because I'm pretty excited for them. And what else did I get? Oh, these are great. So as far as breakfast goes, I got a little bit nervous because usually we will stay at a hotel that just serves like the continental breakfast. And pretty much the only thing I could probably eat from that is just the fresh fruit that they give you. Um, so that would be fine, but I also wanted something extra. So I saw these as I was walking down the aisles. These are the Santa Cruz organic apple, cinnamon applesauce. So they're the little squeeze packets. They look like this. It's just a different brand. So I picked them up in the Sprouts Organic brand and the Santa Cruz brand. And so I had six of them because we're going to be gone for six days. So these are just super good cinnamon applesauce. And the ingredients in this are super good. It's organic apples, water, organic apple juice concentrate, vitamin C, and organic cinnamon. So same ingredients in both. I'm really excited to try these. They sound super yummy. Apple cinnamon just like sounds so good and warm. So I hope that these are good and I love that they're organic. And next I got this big huge bag of blue corn chips. I got these as a snack to go with some salsa. I thought this would be a good more filling option than just like some chips or something to just keep in our hotel or cabin. I'm not sure what we're staying in. I think it's more like a cabin setup. So I will keep this in here. I just got the Sprouts Cilantro Lime Salsa, and then I have no idea how you pronounce this, but blue corn chips. And the ingredients for this is organic blue corn, organic palm oil, 
water, lime, and sea salt. And the ingredients in the salsa are diced tomatoes, green bell peppers, onion, cilantro, sea salt, distilled vinegar, crushed tomatoes, garlic powder, garlic, lime juice concentrate. So both very clean and also super yummy. I'm really excited to have this. I love chips and salsa. It's just such a yummy snack, like anytime, anywhere. And next, I'm so excited about this. I had a <clears throat> genius idea as I was walking through the aisles of Sprouts. I passed the salad dressing and marinade section and it rang a bell that when we go out to eat at restaurants and stuff for the whole six days we're gone, eating out's gonna be super hard for me. I'm sorry, my voice sounds so weird right now. I don't know what's going on. <clears throat> but I figured I could buy my own salad dressing and then eat salads at most of the restaurants we go to because typically I can't have salad dressings. The base of them is mostly soybean oil, which I'm allergic to soy. So as I was walking by, I picked up two different salad dressings and I'm going to bring these to all the restaurants we go. So the first one I got is Sir Kensington's Classic Ranch with 100% sunflower oil. So I picked up this one because I love ranch and I wanted to have like a creamy option. And then I also picked up this small batch Organicville olive oil and balsamic vinaigrette so that I have like a vinaigrette option and a creamy option just depending on how I'm feeling for that meal. And both of these are very clean ingredients of course. Um, I'm not gonna read all of them because there are a lot of ingredients, but this one is vegan. And this one does contain eggs, but I'm hoping that they're both good. I don't see how they wouldn't be, but yeah. So I got salad dressings. I'm so excited about that because now I feel like I'm not going to have to stress figuring out what to eat. I'll just order a salad everywhere and use my dressings. All right, I have one more bag to go through. So I picked up these Yes Peas from Pop Chips in the Farmhouse Ranch flavor. I've never heard of these before, but Sprouts had them on sale. It was buy one, get two of them free. So I did buy two bags. I figured I might as well get all three bags if I'm going to be spending the money for the one because the other two are free. So I went ahead and picked these up. These don't have like the cleanest ingredients. There's like a lot of seasonings and this does have dairy ingredients but i figured it was just a healthier option than grabbing like ruffles or something so i grabbed three bags of these because the first ingredient on them are peas so why not snack on vegetables when you can so three bags of these and the ranch flavor the only other flavor they had was just salt and that's boring to me especially because i don't really like salt so got the ranch for all three of them and then two things left I've never seen these before, but I went ahead and grabbed them. These are the Snack Freely Organic Crunchy Rice Rollers in the apple cinnamon flavor. So they look like this. They're like little tubes of rolled up brown rice crispies. They looked good. I don't know. They draw my attention. And the ingredients are super good. It's organic whole grain brown rice, organic brown rice syrup, organic cane sugar, freeze dried organic apples, organic flavors, and organic cinnamon. So I figured these could maybe be used for breakfast as well, or of course, just like a snack throughout the day. And I liked how they came in these little convenient tubes. I feel like that's gonna be really easy to travel with. So I got those in apple cinnamon. And the last thing I picked up are these organic Lundberg Family Farms Thin Stackers. These are puffed grain cakes in the basil and thyme flavor. And they're basically just organic brown rice cakes, but they're a lot thinner and they're in like a square. And the ingredients on these are brown rice, sea salt, marjoram, basil, oregano, thyme, sage, and everything is organic. So I really, really hope that these are good because these I will actually buy as like an everyday snack when we come back if I like them because they were a good price. I think it was like three or four dollars. There's 24 rice cakes in here and they're super good ingredients and these are cool because they're flavored so you can eat them plain or you can dress them up by putting like um, things on top of them. So I hope that these are good and I these are kind of one of the only like savory things I got. I feel like everything else I got is a little bit sweet. Actually that's not true. But these seem to be like the healthiest thing that I picked up. 
So I'm really excited for them. And that's everything I got, you guys. I really hope everything I picked up is good because everything I'm trying is brand new to me besides the popcorn and besides these that I've already opened them. So I hope everything else is good because this is basically what I'm going to be living off of for the six days that we're gone, minus salads at restaurants. So hopefully everything is really good. Comment down below if you guys have tried any of these or if you want to try any of these. Everything was from Sprouts, like I said, so it wasn't super expensive. I feel like as far as health stores go, Sprouts is the cheapest compared to like Whole Foods and Trader Joe's. I just love going to Sprouts and they have so many options for like snacks and stuff like that. So I absolutely love Sprouts. So yeah, comment down below what snacks you guys have tried out of these or if any of them you want to try. And please leave this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, if you found it helpful. Um, and make sure you subscribe before you leave. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.